Hello and welcome to the new video in this channel which is about how we can clean up the WinSXS folder. WinSXS folder exists in Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8 and Windows 10 and in the previous versions. This folder was known as the DLL cache folder. WinSXS stands for Windows side by side and it is used to store critical components store information. This folder is located at C, Windows, Win SXS. The main purpose of this folder is to be used during installations, Windows updates, upgrade or patches for the service packs, and hotfix installs. Windows SXS folder contains all the files that are needed for a Windows installation and updates. Due to the functionality and nature of WinSXS folder, it can grow huge over time as more updates, roles and features are added to it. It uses the NTFS file format to increase robustness. The main reason for why it becomes huge and shows a large size overall is because of the way Windows Explorer works with hard links. It counts references to hard links as a single instance, for example, if a file called test.dll is 700 KB and is located in WinSXS plus Windows and System32 directory, it will inaccurately report the file to be consuming 1400 kilobytes of space. To remedy this, Windows has provided a built-in feature called a disk cleanup which can be used to free up space in this folder. The first method that we are going to cover in this video is by using Disk Cleanup. Open Disk Cleanup by clicking on the Start menu. Type Disk Cleanup. You will see the application res resulting on your search. Right click on this application and say Run as Administrator. And they, it will calculate the space for a few minutes and then it will show you the options now here it's usually in C drive so if you have more than one drive it might ask you to select a drive but usually it's the windows are installed on c drive so it will automatically bring up c drive as selected so let's clean let's click on clean up system files wait for the process to get complete now we need to enable the windows update cleanup option and then click on OK. If you cannot see the option to clean up system files or Windows Update Cleanup, then you'll need to run Windows Updates and install them. If there are updates pending, this won't work and shouldn't be forced. So now let's click on OK. So it will begin the process and it will delete all these files from your C drive. You will need to wait for the process to complete. It might take few minutes to complete the process. Now we have another method which is called cleanup component store via command prompt. Let's click on start and type cmd. Once you get the results, right click on command prompt and click on run as administrator. Click on yes when you are prompted for user account control prompt. Now, when you are in command prompt, type DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash analyze component store and hit enter.
wait for the operation to complete so once the process completes and here it says component store cleanup recommended yes and then you can use this command jism forward slash online space forward slash cleanup image space forward slash start component cleanup and hit enter so i hope this video will be helpful for you thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe our channel